So guys, I wanted to welcome you to Destiny and also tell you something really neat that I discovered the other day. And that's that you're the best audience on YouTube. Not sure if you're aware of that. Just thought I'd put that out there. There's no pressure. But, um, anyways, just on a serious note, thank you so much for everything. You've changed my life. And I couldn't have handpicked a better group of people to be with to experience these games with me. So, I know it's over the internet. It's all, like, indirect and all that. But I feel like it's a close family. It really is. Anyways, you guys are awesome. I'm giving away three copies of this game, any system preference. Just leave a comment below of your choice. And about a week after the video has been up, I'll announce the winners on Twitter and Facebook. And with that being said, first part of Alpha, I played as Warlock. I gotta up my sensitivity. I played as Warlock. I thought it was really good. But when I played the beta, I only did a few videos for each of these, so you won't... There wasn't too much of the story spoiled, hopefully. Uh, the Titan was a lot... A lot more up my alley. It's more like, this is Gandalf, and this is the Terminator. And that's kind of what I'm going as. I want to be Arnold, alright? I'm going to play as Titan, probably. We'll kind of see how it goes. I might change it up. I might make different profiles, but... Um, the first part of those series did really well. Be amazing to break 50,000 likes in this video. It's not required, but it would be sick to see. So with that being said, enjoy this and let's do this. We called it The Traveler, and its arrival changed us forever. Great cities were built on Mars and Venus. Mercury became a garden world. Human lifespan tripled. It was a time of miracles. We stared out at the galaxy and knew that it was our destiny to walk in the light of other stars. But the Traveler had an enemy, a darkness which had hunted it for eons across the black gulfs of space. Centuries after our golden age began, this darkness found us. And that was the end of everything. But it was also a beginning.
Don't survive long out in the open like this. Let's get inside the walls. So I wanted to say uh, we're finally playing. This does resemble the start of the beta, so there might be a little bit of similarities. The good thing is I only did two videos on that, uh, so the game shouldn't be too much different. Let me just look around really quick, see if they changed anything else. It looks pretty much the same. Uh, I'm just glad that it's a full series now. Like it's not, there's not a stopping point when you get to a certain area. So weird because I play on. Okay. Oh, hang I on. I need to find you a weapon before the fallen find us. Just so you know, I play on inverted and I play on jumper. Quiet. They're right above us. Find a weapon. We already. Ooh. Hang on. I didn't. I can't remember this part too much. I think they changed a little bit of stuff here and there. Hang tight. Fallen thrive in the dark. We won't. We need more light. I'll see what I can do. Another one of these hardened military systems, and a few centuries of entropy working against me. Oh my goodness. Oh, time to go. Let's go, let's go. I found a rifle. Grab it. Oh, I got the, uh... Little assault rifle. I hope you know how to use that thing. <laughs> yeah, this Your feels a little bit different. Watch your tracker. They definitely polished up the game since the beta and alpha. I will say that. Oh shit! This does have that drop in, drop out kind of co-op, so it'll be really nice to see. Probably see some of you in the videos and stuff. I'm playing on PS4. I do have it for Xbox One as well. I wanted to kind of see, see the difference and pick which one I wanted to play on. But for the most... Oh, get out of here. For the most part, it plays really smooth on both systems. Uh, the game, I had to wait for the servers to drop. I had the games really early. Yeah, this is a little bit different. This is just pretty much a little training tutorial. Now, the good thing is I didn't put too much effort into the beta and alpha because I knew that... Like, the character really wouldn't matter too much. There we go. But yeah, I kind of hope to see this be a full series. We'll just have to see how the videos do and uh, go from there. Oh, come on, man. I bet I can melee this guy and kill him in one hit. Watch this. Nope. Close. Very close. There's so, in case ahead. you're not sure... Keep it up. Let me see if I can... Okay, yeah, we're still just going this way. I, I love the way they did, like, the navigation and stuff. Cash. Let's see what's inside. Oh, we got it. Okay, so we got something else there. So now I have a shotgun. This gun looks so sick. Now, right now, I am playing as a warrior. Trip mines. Don't touch them. Pretty much. Really? Are you kidding? At least they're smart enough to not run through there. Guess we just go back here, right? Seems like the easiest easiest way to do this. Right now I'm playing as the servers have just came online. You couldn't actually even play the single player without the game being like logged onto the servers, so I'm not sure how I feel about that. 
so everyone has to wait at the same time. But I also have it, I'm playing where not a lot of people are probably playing it right now. I think like New Zealand is the, like one of the first countries to have it. I love the music too, look at this music. Little soundtrack we got. Yeah, I'm gonna change my sensitivity a little bit. It's, I wouldn't say it's too high, but it just feels a little too, like I'm missing the targets a little too much. Man, this game feels very polished. I didn't think I'd see much of a difference between the alpha and beta. And then I, you know, but of course the final game comes out and it feels almost 100% different. They probably took like the best parts and just kind of kept going with it. Oh, get out of here. But for this first, the, probably the first few videos will just be me. And then after a while you'll see other people join. And I finally got my mic set up to where I can actually communicate. So as people join me, it'll be kind of like DayZ where I'm able the to talk and everything. Better hold on this place than I thought. Just a little bit further. Let's hope there's something left out there. This is very smooth so far. All right, we're in the divide area. This was an old Cosmodrome. There's got to be something we can fly out here. Incoming. Oh no. The shockwave over there. Fallen ships this close to the surface. Move. Uh, what? Oh, we're supposed to get over here. All right, let's get out of here. So basically the fallen ships, now this looks like they combined it with another area. So this is a little different. Oh my goodness, guys. I've got a pretty much... I'm gonna, you know what, I wouldn't sit here all day and kill everyone I come across. Because you can also, uh, like, evade everything. But I do want to level up my character as much as possible. On the alpha and beta, I really didn't focus on that too much. Come on, shield, go back up. Yeah, they, it's like they combined a whole different area with it. Because I don't remember this at all. Alright, Vandal. You going down, bitch. I was going to ask you guys, what's the first game you ever watched me play? Or if this is it, I'm just curious. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm in deep trouble right now, guys. Hang on. Back up, back up, back up. Yeah, I've been doing this YouTube thing since April of 2010. And I don't know how many games I've actually played through. I know it's been a lot, though. But I'm just kind of curious when you found my channel and stuff. Always fun to see that. Everyone starts in different little areas. So they... I thought it would be just like the beta, but they definitely... It's definitely different. It's not, I don't think any of this was in the beta. I'm just hoping I can have a perfect run without getting killed at the start of this series. I gotta just be careful. Alright, we're leveled up. Let's actually go ahead and take care of this. I didn't do this too much the first time. I kind of wanted to see what we got. Uh, we got... That requires level 15. Let's see if we got anything else. Nothing right now. So, uh, you also have... Let me see something else. Let me look at the, like, the equipment... All that changes. I don't think... If you've never seen any of this stuff, I'm just kind of showing you now. Just so you can have an idea of what we're doing. And materials. This is kind of when you get other things. As you beat missions... Wait, it says mission 0 of 10. The game can't be that short, can it? I don't think it is. I'm picking up signs of an old jump ship. Could be our ticket out of here. Okay, so it's basically telling me to do that. Let me go ahead and do this. Go to my abilities. Alright guys, so right now it keeps asking me to do this. I figured I'd go ahead and do this to get it off the screen. But this is kind of how you upgrade your subclass. As you kind of keep going through. Right now we just got flashbang grenades, so. Yeah, it definitely feels like... Oh, hang on, let me try that out. Looks like the sticky grenades from Halo 2. The way it bounces and all that. 
Oh, get back. Yeah, it definitely feels more like a final game than just a little beta, so they definitely... They definitely polished up what was using pretty much all the good parts of the beta. There's a ship. Clear him out. Oh, let me, uh... I gotta wait for the grenade to come back. Yeah, because I don't really remember any of this stuff, so I'm thinking that most of it's pretty much new. Come on, grenade, come back. This is right when I should be... I should have saved it, but... Okay, we got that guy down. Now, I will be doing some online multiplayer game. I'm not really sure how I'm going to do it yet. But I do know that for the most part... I did play a few things here and there. I think it's Warlock that I was using then, though. Let me see if this grenade will do anything. Let's clear out that little area. Okay. A level 1 Devil Captain. Pretty sure we can take him down. I was trying to get everyone else, too. Okay, we're good. You know, every time I think of Warlock, I, th I think about the map on Halo 2 called Warlock. I don't know why I think of that. There's going to be a All lot right. of Halo references in this, I guess. I get us out of here. It's been here a while. Hasn't made a jump in centuries. We're lucky the Fallen haven't completely picked it clean. Will it fly? I can make it work. going to break orbit. It just might get us to the city. Now, about that trans man. Bringing you in. You can come back for them when you're ready. Let's get you home. Alright, so that was the first, I guess, official mission of the game. I'm guessing we continue at this point. We can kind of see the mission summary if we need to. A Guardian Rises kind of shows you how much... I didn't die at all. I'm happy about that. Let's keep this rolling, though. Welcome to the last safe city on Earth, the only place the Traveler can still protect. It took centuries to build. Now, we're counting every day it stands. And this tower is where the Guardians live.
So guys, this is actually the character that it auto-generated for me, so I kind of went with it just to see... Oh, there's actually other people right now. So, I think at the start of the beta, they give you a few extra items here and there. Really awesome. People are already level 5? Are you kidding me? How can I Let's go ahead and get all these spe little special abilities we can get. This is how you get, uh, thank you for helping us during the beta loads. Oh, nice! Sign of Elders. Okay. Bye. So we get free stuff for just playing the beta and everything. That's awesome. Let me run down here. But yeah, this is kind of the way the game is. I, I don't have my mic plugged in. I didn't plan on talking to anyone the first video. I just kind of want to get and collect everything that I can. Relax, Titan. I will fight. So you kind of go and get all the stuff. Welcome to the fight. Good. I did get something for getting the game early. I don't know what it was, though. So you basically, you gotta level up your character all the way to get all this stuff. There's so much, it really has that mass effect appeal to it, so... I'm Stick pretty pumped about way. this. Let's see what he has. Nothing that all I can right, buy, yeah. right? <laughs> Nothing that I can buy yet. I just wanna see what everyone's got. I'll probably kinda show you around on this little area. Stay safe, I think it's really there. awesome. The character that they auto-generated for me doesn't look too bad. I was kind of worried about that hairdo, though. They don't make it to the drop in an but I don't know if I'll keep this character. I just, for the first video, I just kind of want to just make whatever happens, happens. Look at these graphics, though, man. Like, this this whole game is so massive. We're going to finally get to explore all that. All right, let's go ahead and get this. This drives me crazy every time I see this. Anything else? We've almost got the lift. We don't have enough yet, though. All right, let's get out of here. The gunsmith, the tower gunsmith can equip you with better weapons. Okay, we're just kind of going through the motions right now. Just the same way we did with the beta. The alpha and beta, the start of it was kind of the same. I felt like this felt different from the beta. It might have been the same, though. Maybe I just don't remember it that well. The good news is I didn't get too far in the let's beta. Back out there. All right, arm yourself. Choose the weapon. We got the... Uh, Auto rifle, pulse rifle, scout rifle, and the the hand cannon. Oh, I don't know, guys. I'm going to guess this is probably the best one to choose right now. Go ahead and equip it. So right now we're just upgrading our character. There's a few more things we can check first. Let's see if we can collect this and then get out of here. Hopefully we can start the next mission before the video ends. I don't want to make the videos too long. Oh yeah, if you don't know, you can you can just all the way break dance for no reason. I'm not sure how about the how I feel about those moves. Let's go ahead and collect everything we can. I was gonna skip some of this, but I figured it's a brand new journey. We might as well do this. You want a ship? Okay, take this for your journeys. Repairs complete. Oh, it's fast. Now we pretty much have to go down to the bottom to do this. Service by the tower shipyard. Okay, so you that's basically showing that. I don't need to do anything else. And I think we're actually good to go. I don't think I have to even go out there to go to the next mission. Let me see something else really quick. Yeah, let's go ahead and head back this way. Check out all, like, there's so many characters and everything. You can just go to orbit at any time, which is what I'm about to do now. And I'll kind of show you the map and where we'll probably go in the second video if I do make another one. So this is kind of how the uh, beta looked with the menu and everything. You set destination. You kind of, you either go to Earth. The tower is the last day. That's what I meant, Earth. Uh, this is kind of where you go to all the missions and everything. So we just did... Which one did we just do? Didn't we just do this? Restoration level 2 story. I don't think I did that one yet. But anyways, when we come back, I'll do this mission, and then we'll keep things rolling. And all the side stuff I'll kind of skip for now, but I do want to get back to where I was. I think I made it all the way to the Devil's Lair. So with that being said, thank you guys for all the support, and if you want more today, just show that love, and I'll see you on the flip side. Peace.